Hey guys, Justin Bryant here from selfmadesuccess.com. In this video, I'm going to show you eight work from home job sites for finding work. So, if you have seen some of my videos in the past, you've probably seen that I have all kinds of uh, jobs that I recommend for people who want to work from home without having to start your own business. And those things include things like writing, things like customer service, being a personal, being a virtual assistant, uh, transcriptions, all kinds of stuff. There's all kinds of jobs out there that you can do. But this video is going to show you eight of the best websites for finding actual positions that are available right now. So these are all remote jobs where you can work anywhere, typically in the U.S. or there are usually other um, search options if you are outside the U.S. as well. But these are for remote working locations where you do not have to commute to an office and you are able to work from your home with your computer. So the first job site that I want to show you is Flex Jobs. And Flex Jobs is a very big site with lots of traffic and they have a lot of different ways to find jobs. A lot of different categories, a lot of different filters for filtering out jobs that you would want and getting rid of the ones you don't want in search results. And you can see here Right now you see the US page for remote job locations. So um, they have digital partnerships director, they have senior account coordinator for email marketing, web developer, email developer, marketing assistant, all kinds of stuff that is remote. In other words, you do not have a commute. So you can be anywhere basically in the US and apply for these jobs. So to get to this, let me show you how to do it. You can go from the home page. So you're basically on the, uh, when you get to the home page of Flex Jobs, this is like the home page. So then you would go to um, the find a job area or the jobs area. So you can just click jobs up here. Okay, so then you're at the categories area. Then you can do um, find jobs by location. So then it shows you like a map of, this is usually US based, or you can do international, which is a button right there. So for instance, for this example, I'm gonna use the US. Um, and then you can do US jobs that can be done anywhere from in the US. So then you would click that, and then it comes up to that page I was on earlier. So that's how you get to the remote jobs location on flexjobs.com. And they do a very um, rigorous screening process to make sure that these are real companies before they can apply to put job postings on here. So some of those bigger jobs job uh, sites might not be uh, full of legit opportunities. A lot of them might have some um, scams and not so great listings on there, but they do a great job of making sure that they are legit companies. Number two is Glassdoor, and you may have remembered me recommending Glassdoor.com before because they have a section, as you can see up here in the header, that tells you these average salary of different positions in different areas. So you can literally just search jobs and see what the general pay is for a job before you decide to take an interview or to even pursue it. So that's really nice. Glassdoor helps with that. They also have jobs that are remote. So what you would do is in the location settings, let's say you're back on the, if you're back on the home page, you can get rid of the location part and just type in remote. Start typing remote, and then it'll have remote work from home US. This is pretty much a US-based site. 
but once you do that in the location box, don't do it in the job title box, make sure you do it here in the location box, click search, and that will take you back to where I was earlier and it allows you to work remotely from home. So um, they have all kinds of different jobs that you can look at and things like that. So they even tell you the estimated salary, which is really nice instead of, you know, a lot of companies will leave out the salary, but they give you an estimate of what you can expect. So Glassdoor, one of the best, most transparent job sites you can do, and that is how you search for work from home jobs. Number three is Pro Blogger, and Pro Blogger is more for writers. So if you're interested in writing, doing blog posts, doing freelance articles, or even getting a job position as a writer full time or part time, you can find all kinds of positions on here. And many of them are uh, remote. So you can work from home. Many of them are freelance. You could do full time. Uh, they have contract, they have part time, they have location based, they have non location based. For instance, instead of saying a specific city like this one does it'll say like just United States or anywhere if it's remote or remote location so those are the types of things you'll notice most of them are remote or anywhere when you go down the list they have a lot of jobs always being posted on here you'll notice a lot of times there's you know a few being posted per day or you know dozens being posted per week on here and it is literally nothing but writing blogging and stuff like that or editing so if you're good at writing you know writing you're good with that stuff then pro blogger is specific to only those types of jobs very good design uh, page for the site very easy to search location or the type of job you can look at full-time freelance contractor part-time and a lot of companies post on here now Number four is Jobspresso. So Jobspresso is actually based more on remote work from home type of jobs. So you don't really have to do any kind of categories or anything on Jobspresso like I did on FlexJobs and Glassdoor because they are pretty much only for remote jobs. And as you can see here, if you just go to the regular jobs section, it's pretty much all remote jobs. So you can look at things like customer software trainer, customer success manager, system administrator, um, developer. There's all kinds of stuff that you can do working from home. And you see that they say anywhere, anywhere in the US, US, UK, Canada, Germany. So some of these are even international. In fact, quite a few of them are. So you can even uh, check boxes here, like if you want to do writing jobs, if you want to do various or support sales, um, you know, marketing, whatever you want to do, designer. So it's very easy to navigate this. It gets quite a bit of traffic. There's a lot of jobs on here, and it's basically geared towards remote type jobs. So Jobspresso, definitely one of the better ones, and they um, make it easy for you to find work that's actually remote. Number five is called Remote OK. So Remote OK is kind of like Jobspresso in the fact that it is geared towards remote jobs that you can do anywhere. So as you can see, I'm on RemoteOK.com right now. You can even get uh, daily notifications, as you can see at the bottom there. If you put your name and email and subscribe when new remote jobs are being posted, so it'll remind you. You can even take a look at like the highest paid category, which highlights jobs with six-figure salaries or more. Um, and it's mostly technology-based jobs. So you can also search like non-tech in the search categories but for the most part these are going to be more tech based and you know a lot of remote jobs are going to be tech based so that's just something to keep in mind but 
they have really cool things like the highest paid categories and stuff like that so if you were to say um, you can just click there you don't even have to type in anything and it'll sh instantly show you all kinds of jobs that have been recently posted so um, you know you have remote work statistics you have different categories type of jobs that you can do um, they have different little categories in the jobs there and all kinds of ways to you know filter your results and go by which day the job was posted so you can see how recent it is and stuff like that so it's a really nice way to search jobs and it can be very helpful just to have nothing but remote jobs and search results instead of having to go through and narrow them down like you would in many of the bigger sites. So number six is skip the drive. So skip the drive as you can probably tell by the name is related to remote work work from home type jobs especially so you can go to um, find remote and telecommuting jobs. I'm just on the home page right now. You, I really did not go to any other pages. So right here, find remote and telecommuting jobs, or if you really want to, you can go to browse remote jobs, which is the <laughs> same page. So it's by category that way. So you can see the categories they have. They actually have more categories than a lot of the other ones do, which is nice. So they may have a little more diversity as far as their remote jobs. You can type in pretty much whatever you want, depending on what you're looking for. Um, and as a bonus, they actually help you calculate how much money and time you'll save each year by working from home. So that's kind of cool, if especially if you're going from a regular job with a commute in a big city or something and going to a remote job. So they're all for helping you work from home. Let's say you type in marketing and search I'll show you just kinda of what it looks like and they have you know all kinds of jobs found um, you know email you jobs if you subscribe there if you want notifications um, but they have all kinds of different types of jobs that you can look for and you can find them it's kinda of, it kinda of aggregates them on multiple sites so it's not just on you know it's not just what's posted on here it's like from other sites as well number seven is remotive and remotive is another website that is geared specifically toward remote work so instead of doing indeed or monster and having to go through all those steps to try and figure out if it's a remote job or not uh, you have sites like remotive and some of these other ones I've recently mentioned that will be geared towards only remote work from home jobs. So I'm on the home page here. This is what the home page looks like. You can read more about them and everything. But um, if you want to look at jobs, you can just click jobs up here in the top right corner. They have all kinds of stuff here. Um, just a home page full of jobs. And you can post a job, you can find jobs in specific categories like education, engineering, and stuff like that. And you can just kind of browse through here, see like when the jobs were posted, uh, who posted the jobs, look at the uh, specific um, details about the job, apply for it here by clicking this button and things like that so it's really nice it's a nice uh, website. It's nice design I like the way it looks and everything and um, you can find out more information about the company you can see who founded the company and stuff like that as well so Remotive is another great option if you want to try that and number eight last but not least is called virtual vocations and that is a job specific to you know telecommuting jobs and stuff which is from home so if you just go to the job section virtualvocations.com slash jobs or you just click up here um, then you'll come to a page like this okay so um, you can log in or register 
um, to use more search filters and things like that. So it can be well worth it if you want to get extra filters and make your searches a little bit better. It's not going to cost anything when you do that. You're just basically um, showing them that you're serious and um, helping them remind you of future jobs and stuff like that. And then you get access to the different categories, job types, and all that stuff. So um, you can see some of the jobs that are on here already when they were posted. As you can see, they have a ton of jobs that have been posted very recently. So they get a lot of traffic probably more so than a lot of the ones I've mentioned um, but they have a really nice platform and like I said virtual vocations is all about telecommuting from anywhere and working from home and things like that and they also have a Twitter feed that you might check out if you look up virtual vocations on Twitter or you can just go down here and click there it's at virtual vocation that is their Twitter handle so that's pretty much it for this video. If you feel like you got something from this video, if you feel like you learned something that's helpful for helping you find remote jobs where you can actually work from home and some of the sites that show you what's available right now, please like and subscribe so I can create more videos like this for you. Also, if you want to let me know what you thought about the video or mention some other websites that you think are great for searching for remote location jobs that I didn't mention, let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you and get your feedback and hopefully we can add to the conversation with this and help anyone who watches this video get the most information they can. And also the links I mentioned, the show notes, the related content to this video will all be at selfmadesuccess.com for you in one page. I'll try to have that up for you in the next few days, and there will be a link in the description to that page as well. So other than that, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope you have a great day.